Hey guys, I'm back to the channel. There is a new pet merge update in Prodigy, so let's get into the video. Alright, so this merge does not apply to us, as in our wizards. It actually applies to our enemies. So our enemies now have a merge. Um, we've sort of seen this in some of the trailers that Prodigy's been releasing. They've had like a purple uh, sort of button next, to, or I guess merge, next to pets. And now this is actually a thing that we can see in-game. So if we go ahead and head into this battle right here, um, we are going to see that these pets should have a merge of their own. So yeah, this one right here has a merge of five. And then Prism Tongue, I think it is, also has a merge of five. So this makes battles a lot more difficult. I'm going in here with Nebluff and Shiver Tusk. Um, and this battle should be pretty hard. I did actually get pretty low last time. Like, I um, I was getting sort of worried that I was going to lose. Um, but I did not really have my best pets in. So this time, I am going into this battle. And these pets are still merged. But I think that this one shouldn't be as hard since I put in Nebluff, which is my best, or my second best pet before I was using, I think, Glimmerwing, which isn't that good. But this does make battles a lot harder, like before I would probably go for Impale right here because it would probably take out Prism Tongue. Now I'm not going to go for it because um, stuff spells do a lot less damage. So you can see that also the pets that I'm going up against, the opponents, they have a lot more health, which they probably would have had about 2,500 before, and instead they have 3,180. Um, I think that the max might be 5, um, I'm pretty sure last battle all I saw was 5 as the max merge, and I know that for wizards, or for our pets, you can get up to 6, I haven't seen 6 on any of my opponents yet, so... We're just going to go ahead and do a few more of these battles. I do want to test to see if they show up against, like, Sir Constello. And if they show up in hard mode as well, because I kind of feel like hard mode would be probably one of the most appropriate places to see these um, merges. But I think we're going to do one more of these Starlight Festival daily battles before we get into the Sir Constello battle. So... I have to go ahead and try to find the star, so I'll see you guys when I find it. Alright, so here is the third daily battle I'm doing today, and um, I assume we should still see some merge rank 5. Okay, we are facing some shadow pets this time, I assume that'll make the battle a little more easier. Yeah, all of them are still on a merge rank of 5, which sort of makes me think that the highest you can get is 5. Also, that was a Crystal Monster spell right there. I don't remember any other pet besides for the Crystal Monsters being able to use uh, those spells. I think we'll probably want to go Astral Blast here. Um, so yeah, we have Tenebris, I think that is, to about half health, and we should be able to use... Uh, this spell to take him out. So, nope. Um, so this battle is not going great so far. Um, our Nebluff is probably going to get taken out. I may call it Heckin during this video because that's what it's nicknamed. So, okay. And it dodges again. Um, 101. Yesterday I was doing these battles and Shiver Tusk missed like every single time. It was like it got dodged against every single time I did this. So we're going to use Glare right here, um, which does take out Tenebris. The other two dodged it. I guess we will see more dodges with this because they're going to have higher dodge. So that would kind of make sense that I'm missing a lot more spells than I use. Er, getting a lot more spells dodged. There's another one. So, um, we could get our Nebluff taken out right here, but we don't. They decide to heal instead. So, 
I don't think anything too interesting is going to happen for the rest of this battle, so I'll see you guys when I hopefully win it. Alright, so this should go ahead and finish off the battle. It wasn't too close there, but now we're going to get into a battle against Sir Constello, because I think that we probably will see a merge rank 5 in there as well, if not a merge rank 6. Again, I don't know if pets or your enemies can get up to a merge rank 6. I only know that your own pets can. So, I think we're going to have to spend 5 magic coin to do this, but let's go ahead and see what we can do here. It's 10 magic coin, we're fine with that. So, let's go ahead and see if Lyaglow and whatever his name is, are going to have a merge. Okay, yeah, they do. So this is going to make this Sir Constella battle a lot more interesting. Um, and my pets probably aren't the greatest for this. Actually, they're probably fine. Um, because of... So let's go ahead and go for Lucentail. I think this is... Um, I think that we could potentially take it out right here. We have, uh, I think Pulsar Impact. Yeah, or Pitch Black. So, okay, yeah, there we go. We took out one of them. Um, I think that we're in a pretty decent spot already in this battle. Um, let's go ahead and do Lyaglow right here, 970. And I don't think Sir Concella will be any more powerful. Um, I don't know which Sir Concella I'm facing, though. I could be facing... Okay, I'm facing just Astral 1. But... One thing is that there's, like, a Sigma, Omega, and Alpha version of Sir Constello, and that's what I was wondering about which one I was facing, because I really have no idea. So that takes out Lyaglow right there. That was pretty good. So, now we're going to go ahead and use the only usable spell, Frost Spear. So, that does 994 damage. I think that we're probably going to win this, unless something really weird happens. So, I'll see you guys once I finish this battle. Alright, so we did end up losing both of our pets, but I think we should go ahead and end up the battle right here. Yeah. So, the next place that I'm going to see if we can find some merged pets is in, uh, like, Shiver Chill Hard Mode. Um, one thing that I should have tried out in those battles, I guess we could go ahead and try them out in a normal battle. I want to see if you can catch these pets and if they'll maintain their merge rank, because that would be pretty OP, I think. So, I think guess we'll go ahead and find a shooting star in here. Actually, let's go ahead and go into, like, hard mode and see if we can try to find one. And we'll just catch one of the pets in there. So, let's go ahead and head into the Shiver Chill hard mode. And let's go ahead and see if we can find some merged pets in here. Alright, so let's go ahead and hop into this battle and... Let's see what happens. I sort of expect them to have merges, but I'm not 100% sure. So let's see. Okay, yeah, they do have merges as well. So we can go ahead and check out if they're actually going to keep that merge when we capture them. I think that I'm going to probably try to go for Shade up here. Um, I th think that that'll probably cost the least amount of magic coin. Hopefully we don't actually have to spend any magic coin to actually see if they maintain the merge. Hopefully it says that on the pet card. Um, so let's go ahead and I don't think this will take him out. Let's go ahead and see. Okay, it did. Well, that's why we still have two more pets that we can go ahead and try and capture as well. So... Let's go ahead and use Frost Spear. I need to make sure that I don't kill this one. Okay, that is good, because we should be able to do about 1,000 damage right here on this next hit with Nebluff, which I think will get um, this Ice Creator or er, Collar into a good spot. Okay, yeah, this should 
be low enough to capture it. Yes, it is. And let's see, can we... Okay, we can't see if it's going to show the pet card. Let's see, do we get to keep the merge? Um, okay, okay I don't think it keeps the merge. That's kind of sad. But um, it probably would be a little OP if that was the case. Um, so we're going to go ahead and finish this battle and see if it actually does keep the merge in the pet book, because it could have just been something that doesn't show on the pet card. So the next place that I do want to try this is probably the last place I'm going to look. I want to see if it's in Dragon Isle. Right now, there isn't like any special rift for Starlight Festival, like the Astral Rift. Um, I think will probably come out tomorrow, but it's not here right now. So, um, we wouldn't be able to check in there, but I want to see if it's in normal rifts, because I feel like that would probably be one of the places that it would be likely to be in. So, let's go ahead and finish up this battle, and we will head over to Dragon Isle. And also, it looks like our Ice Collar did not have a merge, so that was a waste of 30 Magic Coin, and it looks like you cannot get merged pets from just capturing them out in the wild. Now, we are going to go ahead and head into a rift. Um, I think I'm only on rift 23, so we might not get a merged pet here, but let's go ahead and head into one of these battles. Um, I guess I could also just, like, check out and see if there's in, like, just some random normal place. Let's go ahead and use these pets, even though, uh, I don't really care what pets we use. And let's see, do these pets have a merge? Okay, they do not. I think that we probably won't see any merges in just, like, our normal area as well, like Firefly Forest, like, just facing a level 10 pet. Because if it's not in Dragon Isle, I assume it also probably wouldn't be in just some random place in the wild. Hard mode does make sense, and I guess Starlight Festival does make sense as well. But I don't think that we would see it anywhere else. Also, we're not really doing a lot of damage right here. Um, I don't think there's really anything interesting else to talk about, so I'm just gonna go to the end of the battle. So, yeah, I don't think that there are going to be any other places where you can see uh, opponents that are merged. So that is going to go ahead and end the video. Let me know what you guys think of this new update in the comments. Make sure to like and subscribe if you enjoyed, and bye.